At LockDock Security, our mission is to help you protect your people and your property. I'm Kevin Starr, and with me today is Eric Brown, and today we're answering a really big question that we get from a lot of our customers. How do I keep track of my doors? Yeah, so this is a co uh, conversation we have a lot, right? We get questions from our customers specifically who handle uh, large amounts of doors, not so much someone who's going to have one door at one suite, you know? So a property manager who handles a lot of openings, um, they have an issue where they're like, hey, how do I keep track of this number of doors? You know, how do I, how do I really make sense of all this information on my doors? So we actually offer something called a door survey. And what it means is we actually go to every single door and we put this unique QR sticker on. Of course, I have two of them here. So uh, basically every single QR sticker is unique. We mm -hmm. put it on the door and all that information is specific to that specific opening. Awesome. So I see on here that you've got like a, a QR code with this number. So I'm assuming that's something you scan using a mobile device or a computer or something like that? Exactly. Yep. So you can scan it for really, really quick access or you can use the ID, which is a numeric value, of course, uh, to type it into the system and, and see all the information that's tied to that door. So if I'm a building engineer or a, a property manager and I, like, you know, I've got, let's just say I've got 200 doors. Um, and I'm trying to keep track of all the information that I could possibly, uh, you know, keep on these openings. What kind of things, can, what kind of information can you get or can you record about, you know, what, what the door is? Sure. So the cool thing with this system is we can actually have a, an infinite amount of information essentially that we put into these doors, uh, we put into each ID. Uh, so basically we can start with, you know, something as simple as the uh, door material. So wood door, hollow metal door, uh, lock type, lock manufacturer, and then even if we conduct a rekey on the door, we can actually keep track of the specific pinning information so that, you know, if the customer calls later on down the road and says, hey, I need a key for this door, uh, we've got that information, we can cut the key and bring it right to them. Awesome. So. So I could essentially get rid of this giant notebook in my desk that has all these key codes and cuts in it and I can know exactly what I've got and, and what I have left. That's that's awesome. Yep. Uh, so like, you know, in, in addition to that, you know, what are some other benefits, you know, from, from using this system? I mean, I'm assuming I'd have to have a computer or something like that on site or is it, I mean, how, how does this information access? So yeah, you can actually access it through a computer, but you can also access it through a phone. So like you said, you know, a lot of, a lot of property managers are out there with their big notebooks stuffed with paper. Uh, it's hard to search things. It's hard to find things. Oh, it's uh, incredibly it's, hard. It's, yeah, it's messy. It's inefficient. Um, so basically, this system accessed once again through a, a computer or a mobile device through an app um, specifically called OMS, uh, mm -hmm. Opening Management System. Awesome. So uh, like, let's say you guys are out doing some work and, and we're tracking the history on that. How often is that information updated? Oh, every time, basically every every time we go on site and touch a door, uh, mm -hmm. we're going to update the information on that specific So it's essentially, opening. it's a live view. It's a real-time view of what's going on in the building. Absolutely. Yep. Awesome. So could you use a lot of this information, like say if, I've, if I'm getting audited by a fire inspector or a health inspector and they want to see a record of all the work that's been done on the door, what products are on there, is that something that, that I can easily see? And not only for that, but like for warranty purposes as well. Yeah, absolutely. So, you know, if, if the fire inspector wants to see all the fire doors, that's as easy as the click of a button. You go in, you say, hey, filter all doors that are associated with fire doors. So basically it's going to filter all those out. You're only going to see the fire doors until you back up on that request. Sweet. Mm -hmm. So okay. yeah. Cool. So I, can, so I can really filter it down, you know, pretty much to a granular level. If all I wanted to see were stairwell doors or suite entry doors, that's, that's just like you said, just as simple as setting a filter and taking a look at it. Yeah, exactly. And another cool thing we haven't actually mentioned is that uh, you add photos to these as well. So not only do you have this information, but right there in the app, you can see uh, built in. So I got OMS. a visual representation yep. to go along with this number. And uh, you know, I'm assuming that, you know, we, we can also put like suite numbers, floor numbers, things like that on there. Absolutely. Yep. Man, that would make life so much easier. Mm -hmm. if, you're a pro if you're a property manager or a building engineer who has trouble managing lots of doors, please give us a shout here at LockDoc Security. We'll be sure to help you out. And if you need more information, check us out on LockDoc.net. Thank you.